All right, y'all, we are back really quick with the Free Trust Carry unit. I'm not saying the whole name. <laughs> it's Carry in the color Cherry. Here are some of the other colors that it comes in. And um, yeah, very nice stock card. I wish that they saved, you know, a little bit of the money they spent on the stock card and invested a little more in the unit, but we're going to talk about that. So it is advertised as a totally glueless unit and I am wearing it glueless right now. I feel very secure and I feel like the lace definitely with just a little lace tint spray melted right into my wig cap and my hairline, you know what I mean, looks good. The um, lace itself though, when I pulled the unit out of the package for the first time, there was two holes in the lace. Now this unit does have the potential and I think somewhere on the, uh, here on the stock card like they show her with it you know braided back and that was my intention to do like maybe a ponytail half up half down type of look but with the having the two holes in the lace that kind of scared me um nothing weird happened like the lace didn't rip or you know there was no additional holes when I cut the lace but if you are planning to get this unit to wear in an updo just be mindful of that and it could just be the unit I got was kind of um shaky in that sense that it had issues with the lace and maybe all of them don't um what i love about this unit of course is that um wide parting area that you give how it lays so flat and kind of natural looking i don't know what the hell my neighbor is up to mind my business anyway um yeah it lays a pretty flat um it's a secure feeling it does have the strap that a lot of wigs use when they call themselves glueless right um, but it's not too tight. I didn't even adjust it. Now, of course, head size is subject to, that's going to be subject to your personal head size. But for me, it was pretty good. Um, so yeah, I love everything, you know, from here to here, the parting space, how the lace lays and blends pretty easily. Um, it ha they give you a nice amount of baby hairs. Most of them, I took just a little bit of edge control and like pushed them back into the unit. I didn't want too much baby hairs. This one, this unit, I don't think it's going to give too much. I mean, you can kind of see that, right? Um, the hair itself is shiny. The texture of it is not that great. It feels a little plasticky. It's not the worst synthetic unit that I've ever had, but it's not wonderful either. Now, my first impression when I took it out of the pack, I was like, well, you know, sometimes, you, you know, you could bleach your natural hair um, and do you know like a semi-permanent or a rinse and you get this kind of like shinier effect but in real life in the daytime it's I'm not loving that okay um the hair does not shed at all but it does tangle quite a bit it's a very long unit um I am 5'3 and it's hitting right here just above my belly button so I know that if I pushed it all towards the back um, and I did have it, so with it all towards the back, it's right, um, right to the, to my butt crack. I don't know why I hesitated to say that, but anyway, um, yeah, it's right to the top of my butt crack and, um, it was tangling. Like I had it, you know, I had it there for, I don't even know, a minute and I was like, yeah, that's absolutely not going to work. Uh, well, I would recommend this unit for somebody that's like 25 and under, um, with the expectation that, hey, you're probably going to wear this like one time, you know what I mean? And you're going to have to constantly brush it and all that stuff. I didn't get into it just the, with the overall quality of the unit. I did not get into, um, you know, any dry shampoo or trying to flat iron. I don't even think, I mean, look how flat it is laying, right? Um, I definitely do not think that this fiber or this hair will hold a curl, um, as you can kind of see. Uh, so yeah. I would re definitely recommend it for someone younger. I'm liking, I'm liking the look that I got though, by the way, you know, I feel like it took about 10 years off of me. Either that or I look like an old lady in a long red wig and I'm still here for that too, okay? Um, oh, look, the hair itself is very, is very thin. Like as I'm running the brush through, so the density, but if they, if they had gone any more dense on this, it would have just been a hot mess, you know what I mean, of the unit. But definitely... You know, it's catching, what can I say? You know, the um, the tracks or the wefts in the unit are immediately catching. Um, so yeah, it's definitely on the thinner side. Uh, and that's another reason I will also be reluctant to try to do too much with like updos or putting up in a ponytail. 
you know, one is the lace and the two, the unit is pretty thin and the quality of the hair is not too great. But it, you know, if you were going to put it up in like a half up, half down or well, not, you know, cause of the, y'all know what I mean, <laughs> a ponytail or whatever, a new twist or whatever the case may be, um, in this area that you do get to do that. I don't think the unit will survive that. Like, I don't think you'll be able to like take rubber bands out and then brush through the unit again and wear it a different way and like wear it like how I'm wearing it and stuff like that. Y'all know that I usually do love to like wear units, take them outside so you can see, you guys can see how they look in the sunlight, come back after I've worn it out and around to let you know how it held up and things like that. If you've ever had a wig in your life, you can look at this easily and tell, right, what this is going to do and what it's going to be good for. So yeah, I might go out and run some errands in it today, but I doubt that I'll come back with any, with any type of update. Um, am I disappointed? No, but you know, knowing, so this one runs on most sites, it's going to run you between like 35, probably 36 to like $42, right? Given that Altre unit that I am so in love with was like the same price, it's, you know what I mean? And the quality is so much better. The color, the texture of the hair, the style, everything about it I love, um, I don't know. This one, this one is just screaming to me like Halloween costume and Halloween is right around the corner. Uh, but yeah, not great, not horrible. Oh, can y'all hear that? I put it next to the mic. Maybe this, cause you know, just to give you an idea of what I'm talking about. This guy's like standing here. He looks like he's taking pictures of something. I don't know what. Maybe it's his girlfriend. Let me not think that he's a creep and a stalker or something. But he's been outside somebody's window taking pictures. Honey. Wait, whoa. Ooh. I don't know. That's what I get now. I got carrying all in my mouth. I mean, he's been. He's either trying to snitch on somebody. Like, oh, you got your dog on your balcony during quiet hours <laughs> or her name baby you should have closed the fucking blinds girl all right this is carrie carrie is so very remember that that's really showing my age carrie is very mm, she's she's here for a good time not a long time I personally would not waste my time, you know, doing a full install with this unit. I just don't think it's worth, I don't even think it would, to me, it wasn't even worth like getting into it with dry shampoo and all that. I feel like it would just be a waste of product and energy. And this unit is just really not going to give too much more than what you're seeing right now. So that's it. That's all. Okay. Love y'all. Peace. <laughs>